It's like we can't take over somebody else stuff because we didn't get what we wanted. Because I'm going to get what I want. Huh. 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 Name it, claim it, it's going to happen to a man. And soon. Hey guys, Nikki here, and this video will be brought to you by Yitta Homes. I will send this lovely bed frame, and I was also sent a cabinet that you store in your bathroom. I would like to really, really thank them for sending this over to me, so let's get straight into it. Both items came in a box, so I did have to assemble them, but I did both of them myself, so don't worry, it was super easy. And this is the current rack that I have. Y'all, I don't care anything about that bathroom because only I go in it, but let's upgrade it a little bit. So that's all the pieces out of the box. I just used my own drill and I put everything together. I don't remember this cabinet being over $100 and I have a discount code that you guys can use and it just added a little bit more spunk to my bathroom now disclaimer i'm going to talk about this why i am building this and yes i am building it because i know somebody go say your man your man your man but guess what this is my house and it ain't it's too soon for all that okay i respect my daughter and my daddy it ain't time to have people all up in my house so let's go back to building this um i will say when you get this measure it it was too big for my tiny bathroom guys so it wouldn't push up against the wall but i still decorate it so you guys can see how it would look but i'm gonna put this in my laundry room um over my washer and you guys will see that in another vlog I am going to keep it. It just didn't fit in my restroom, but it is gorgeous, right? Super gorgeous. So let's move into this right here. This is the bedroom. This whole time I forgot this was a sponsorship and haven't been recording me putting this together, but it's getting done. <laughs> So guys, this was a little bit under $300, but like I said, I have a code and I am absolutely in love with this. I have always wanted a canopy style frame bed, but my ex-spouse was like, no. So I could get what I want now, right? It's just so cute. And you guys know you can hang things over the top, like little sheer, um, I don't, what I forgot what they are called, but like sheer panels or whatever. It's just a beautiful bed. And I'm, if I'm not mistaken, don't quote me on it. This does come in black as well. I really, really love the pieces that I was sent. I really, really love the price point and you guys will too. I want to thank them so much for sending this stuff over to me. And if I was you guys, I would head straight over and check out their website. I am in love with the pieces I was sent. Totally happy. Totally happy. Just added a little bit of mm to the bedroom. Love it. Of course, I will link the bed below the bathroom cabinet below with a discount code thank you so much Eda home for sponsoring this video i am absolutely in love with my pieces hey shilly auntie guys and my baby girl is engaged i wasn't gonna even do an intro for this but i had to find a way to start the video um let's just say this let's just say this i'm over i'm just full of emotions i'm so excited i'm so happy i'm so nervous i'm so everything but my baby girl deserves this so much everything i've been through she's been through we've had three years of pure hell feel like it and i just feel like it knew this was going to make her so happy when my future son-in-law asked me her dad and everything so this is going to be a lot of emotions yeah i'm trying not to cry it's just that my baby girl has when i had my son i was in high school and i went to college my baby girl has literally been here with me every step of the way never too far out of my eyesight have been through everything with me i've sacrificed so much for this young lady and still will i literally get teared up now because she don't want to spend the amount of time with me that i be wanting to spend with her 
um, because I just want to travel the world and do everything with her. But I understand that she's grown now and I got to let her find her way. I'm just so attached to my daughter. Y'all know my daughter comes first. I was sick crawling on the floor still making it happen for my daughter my daughter's sweet 16 that night i went straight to the er for heart palpitations and dizziness but i had to make it happen for my baby girl y'all know y'all have been watching christmas videos for years y'all have been watching um sweet 16 y'all y'all see how hard i go for her and, and this way about to be banana Alright, so it started in another vlog. I was telling y'all that we got some bad, bad news, and I cut it. Um, basically, her fiance is about to go fight in a war. So it was really sad to me, but I had to realize I was born up on faith, I was born up in the church, and he'll be right back. Alright, and that's all I'm gonna say about that. But I'm gonna roll that clip right when I tell y'all, hey, like, what is that? Don't bring me no bad news. Is that uh, the whiz? every freaking day is something and if should don't know by the time this video go live i'm gonna cut this out but her boyfriend done reached out to me and they finna deploy him yeah i have been crying all morning because it's literally like my child and i just i can't imagine his state of mind and i can't imagine how it's gonna put her state of mind he ain't even told his own mama i am so sick like literally ginger ale right here sick i hate that i found this out right before it's time to go but just like everything else that happened in my life i'm just gonna have to keep it pushing but lord i'm so sad is my lashes still on my bottom cried nicole like I know how hard this young man will work to get out of Oak Cliff. And the chances be stacked up against our black men, y'all. Like, oh my gosh, I don't know how hard it is to get out of Oak Cliff. It, it ain't that hard, but like, yeah. Yeah. I'm just, I just send him some prayers and the best, and we're going to keep the faith, and we're not going to act like this today. Go and do what you're trying to do and get on back home. But I am told down, y'all. I am told down. Oh, my gosh. Oh, my gosh. Oh, my gosh. Whew. It's just the, how he was talking to me. Like, I might not make it back. I'm like, oh, no. Nah, we don't talk like that, bro. I know that's what they train y'all and what you got in your head, but now, I, I gotta go, I gotta go. Got tear stains all over my shirt. And so, literally, he had already been talking about it, but I, he was like, Mama, I think it's the time. And I'm like, yeah, go ahead, go ahead. And so, it, it's just a, a lot of emotions. This, this vlog is going to be, it's not a vlog, but it's going to be all over the place because I just recorded clips as I was vlogging and left them out of certain vlogs. But I'm super proud of my baby girl. When I was my daughter age, I already had a two-year-old. So, I am super happy that she's gonna do it the right way get married blah 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 um yeah me and my brother was like is she too young she too this but big grown people can't get it right in love 30 40 year olds marry and be divorced months years later so what does age have to do with it i love t is what i'm gonna call them on here so respectful i already talked about all of that when i was emotional about him leaving and i just feel like i was it meant everything in the world to me to see my baby girl so happy so without further ado let's get into the all right guys i don't i have no idea what vlog this will be in but um Shook about to get a ring, but the problem is her boyfriend, Shook has really small fingers like me. As big as I am, my ring finger is just a five, like Nicole's was even a seven. And um, her her ring finger is like a three and a half, four. So he's having a real hard time finding a ring. He actually found one that he really, really loved. 
and he tried to size it and they told him that if he did the diamonds on the side would pop up pop out and it would mess up the whole ring so yeah let's go heads up found the perfect ring he sent me a picture of the ring he currently got that they can't size or to mess it up and it's nothing like i thought it was gonna be so that helps a lot though because i was like dodging those kind of rings and now i don't have to it's a circle diamond you know now princess cut and all of that is what's in style but um i'm headed back i had to go home because you know he's in the navy so i wasn't finna just sit up in there and wait and i told her to just hold the two but the one i really really like and my whole family really really like is a little too big still they said with these kind of rings, the best way to go is custom, but child, they so young. He don't know nothing about all that kind of stuff, and I don't know what his budget and stuff is yet. So, I told, but I don't want him to have step. So, I even told him if I need to get it, and he just pay me back, that's just what we gonna do. If he pay me back in increments, because we not half stepping. I'm not, and not. I hate the way that sound like I'm too but like if he sees something he like and he can't afford it I don't want him to feel like he can't get it yes you can just use my card and pay it back that's what I that's how I should have said that so let's go baby I love these two because it's gonna start raining on me and everything I am not at Zell's my wig pulling up <laughs> <laughs> all right y'all so look y'all know my baby little pink whispering <sighs> excited is an understatement morning last night was awesome we're about to go run some errands I haven't talked about it much, but Suge is getting proposed to. It will be its own separate vlog. Um, so what happened was her will be fiance by the time you guys see this video, bought a ring and her ring finger is so small. He tried to get it sized and I was like, the diamonds and stuff might come out. So I went and bought a temporary ring um, just so he can do it while he's here. Cause you guys know he's in the Navy and um, the temporary ring um, I'm taking back because it just so happened yesterday the one that he got um, and they customized arrived so we are going to get the coins back so a little update the ring has been returned I'm sitting here right now they they returned it with no I returned it with no problems so I have to meet him now because I want to see the ring he got but the problem is they are freaking joined by the hip all the time so the only time I can like literally talk to him is when she's at work doing clients and it's just like just do you just do you i trust him it's his engagement like my cousin is like let's do this let's do this let's do this because we both didn't get the engagement that we wanted but i'm just like we can't take over somebody else stuff because we didn't get what we wanted because i'm gonna get what i want <laughs> name it claiming it's gonna happen a man and soon and i'm ready again who gonna do something who in the middle of doing my hair and they cancel tonight. It's a flight and a dinner and it's too windy. Out of all the fucking days. Dallas, Lakeisha, Texas. <sighs> Let me think quick. Let me think quick. So he ju I just told him to switch it over to the um geodeck. It's the ball that overlooks downtown because I tried to do the cut gondola ride but they're not booking either because of the wind it's not messing my whole mood my shoulder <laughs> start hurting let me just calm down yeah he's gonna do that well i guess i won't be able to attend it because i don't know how that's gonna go all right guys me and the family can't all make it to epic central in time without ruining the, the surprise without them seeing us or you know something like that so 
I just told him to take her to the tower overlooking Dallas on a date, bring her straight to this room I'm about to book, and we, we're about to have, we're about to, sorry, we're about to go over here and decorate the room with the real you married me on the bed, and that way all his family, all my family, everybody can come as long, don't, don't nobody ruin this, being late, I'm gonna pray, and I'm finna just head straight over the room right now, to the room right now. I'm not feeling my greatest. Um, my father I ate Taco Bell last night, but it's gonna happen for my baby. I don't care if I gotta dip off every five minutes and use the restroom. It's more like um, when I'm acidic and my gut is flared and my uh, gastritis is flared, it hurts me all of my shoulders and everything. But I'm gonna stop talking so much so that I can save battery time and I'm passing right by the Dollar Tree. Alright guys, I'm at the hotel. The line is no longer, baby. And I'm trying to move around quick because she tracked my location everywhere. So I'm going to go park at Hobby Lobby and then um, my cousin is going to pick me up and we'll come back. But I, I'm glad I came to check on them because it's like, I mean, I'm, I'm to the front now, but when I got here, check. This is what we got to work with. We're going to crowd this little room out. Shit, I'm about to fall. <sighs> I never knew this was over here. Mm. Uh, I came in to see. Good, it's not a big space, so we don't have to crowd it with a lot of decorations. Let's go. Up right here. Oh, you can't see. Well, that. you know what? We don't need a lot of this under the tray. Put this oh, yeah, put them by the door. I, that's what I'm trying to say to my door. We're, trying We're working on Will You Marry Me with Kisses. I just know it. Y'all say hey. Hey. It's the crew. Hey. The aunties, the cousin auntie. Big flat. <laughs> <laughs> Anything you want to say to Tamaya? You know what? This time, girl. Say to your niece. Congratulations, guys. We don't get a ticket to the phone. They was just saying hey. Anything you want to say to your niece? Oh, girl, you gotta do it. You can do it. You can do it. Love, love, love. Should. Girl. <laughs> Not the little one. Big should. Big, 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 big wife. Big my should. Right. Congratulations to you. And Amy love you so much. Cheers. Mm -hmm. See, this the cousin. <laughs> Congrats, sugar. This <laughs> other so cousin, Pierre. Yeah, congratulations. Congratulations, love. I'm proud of you. Legend. <laughs> Damari. Congratulations. <laughs> this her daddy. What you got to say, Timothy? Congratulations, Junior. <laughs> Hold on, say it again. Congratulations, Junior. Love you, baby. <laughs> <laughs> beautiful. Come on. I knew it. Oh, oh. oh. <laughs> Come on, Timothy. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> 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 
baby girl finna get married whoa whoa big fiance up in here <laughs> big 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 tapestry oh, and you wasn't even blogging yeah she was because acting like her mama last you night why. didn't want to get out the car because he just kept saying bring your camera bring your camera and i'm like for what i can't edit the video yeah. Well, when you get your computer fixed, and then uh, he just kept. I didn't, and then I, I didn't even know what to vlog because I didn't know what was going on, so I was just confused. She said she had a clue, but she didn't. Then, like, he pulled up to Kohl's. I'm like, what are we at Kohl's for? What is on my skirt? Oh, scrub on the grand channel. I'm just putting the dirty clothes. Yeah, I don't know. It was a success though because it was still a surprise, huh? He had called me. He said, Mama, he said, we ain't going to be able to do this. He was like, I don't think you understand how much she will track your location. <laughs> I said, she needs to start buying her motherfucking business. Mind your motherfucking business. Yeah, I, okay, let me, you want me to tell you how I really knew something was up? Yeah. Okay, so we... I know the way to chicken and pickle because I've been like three times. And I tried to throw you out. <laughs> I was like, this y'all. man done took me the work. chicken. It didn't work. That didn't work at all. Because I wasn't that chicken and pickle. No, not even that. I'm like, nah, that ain't true. They not going nowhere. Because you're you not going nowhere in public with nobody. I'm going to go somewhere now. I'm nervous about it too. Yeah, so I knew. I'm like, and then chicken and pickle. I'm like, my mama is not a chicken and pickle type of girl. <laughs> So anybody I pull with, no, not to take me to no chicken and pickle. So we drove past it once, and then he turned around. So we drove past it again, and then we pulled into the parking lot. I said, yeah, y'all think y'all slick. Then I pulled out the phone, and I checked your location. I said, yeah. And see, what I kept telling him, I was like, don't panic, because I don't care if she know I'm here. I said, just tell her, you too young to check in the room. So I got the room for y'all. He was nervous. He forgot all that. He didn't even want to tell me about the room. He kept saying, like, his homeboys was at this hotel, and he had to go get something from them. I'm like, that's why I really wanted to stay in the car, because I'm like, if that's what's going on, what are I you said, yeah, I used them mama lips. I said, tell her to get her ass out that car. <laughs> didn't want to get out the car. Because he was like, he was like, four times in here. I'm about to just go get something from him, and I'm coming right back. So I was like, what I'm going for? Then my feet was still hurting. So I was like, I don't know. Yeah, it still was a surprise because I told him, I said, it don't matter if she know I'm here. She don't know we are here. She don't know it's a room full of people. Then, okay, we was walking towards the hotel. I clicked your location one more time and I zoomed in on it. And I seen you was inside the hotel. I said, yeah, y'all think y'all. <laughs> Doing too much. That's why I said I knew it when I walked in. 
because I knew you was there, but I didn't know everybody else was See, there. he could have just said, I got us some room, baby. Your mama had to get it because you got to be 21 to check in the room. Now, he was nervous, though. Y'all had been a long, long... Y'all saw it all. It might be its own separate video. I might make it its own video, but... It was a whirlwind from the ring to the location. It was like everything was like trying to not go wrong, but like be difficult. You know what I'm saying? Not as easy as her little ass finger. I just showed her all the rings that we had. I still got the, uh, girl, no, this is what <laughs> when you came in here was telling me, I still got the original box because we switched out to a baby pink box. When you came here, you were talking about my hair. <laughs> He was in the bathroom getting a pink box. I had set it in your bathroom behind your face wash. <laughs> and I said, I'm going to tell her, come here and help me with my hair. You go in the bathroom and get the ring box. <laughs> <laughs> oh, wow. Yeah, it was so hard because they stuck like glue and let she at work. So it was like real hard to like, it was hard. But it's successful. The wedding colors are navy blue, of course. He's in the navy. He got to wear his uniform, blush pink and cream. <laughs> well, how long you go? How long y'all go wait to get married? Till he done. Done what? With his, uh, what's it called? Because what's the point of us, if he going to be on the ship and stuff, I'm waiting till he done. <laughs> she ain't got to move. <laughs> no, but still, I ain't finna be married. And... Yeah. No, no. What you get done in 2026, so that's not that long. Oh, yeah, you can, y'all can do that. They give us me plenty of time to stay because big huncho right here gonna do it big, and you know, I'm the money. I don't know, his other people might have money. That's I'm what just I was talking about yesterday. I was like, this is gonna be a lot, a lot of planning. Why our weddings are, but that's yeah. why you get a wedding planner, and I just cut the check. So we just show up and look cute. Just like we did at your sweet 16. <laughs> we have to do nothing. We have to lift a finger, nothing. <clears throat> so might as well hire Ingrid now. Cause she gonna show out. Yes, yes, yes. So I right, signing off. I got a date. I always got a got date. Ooh, let me turn the camera off because I got to tell Sugar by last night the part I didn't record. <laughs> we talk about everything, y'all. Bye. All right, guys, so I know I scared you the last vlog. Y'all thought I was pregnant this vlog. Y'all thought I was engaged, but that's everything. I'm super proud of my baby girl. She's a certified chef. She's a hairstylist. She's a YouTuber. She owns three businesses. Um, credit's good. She's headstrong. Whatever she want to do, she do it and do it. Number one, top. You hear me? And I just know she'll be a great wife. <laughs> That sounds so weird. That sounds so weird. So, yeah. Stay tuned because this wedding. <laughs> we already got the colors and everything. It's not It's not soon, soon. But hopefully you guys will be around for the ride. Signing off.